When you look at the challenge facing the Moore School, we basically have a very sacred task. And that sacred task is to equip our students, whether they are undergraduates, whether they are graduates, whether they are PhD students, for the work and the jobs that they will encounter over their careers. And it was pretty obvious to me when I got here that the fundamental material to do that was here. The only thing that I think was missing is if we weren't really pushing our students hard enough. The nature of human work that is now appearing in front of us demands higher skills, higher capabilities, the ability to do more complex work. And if we are going to prepare our students to do that, we have to ask more of them. Fundamentally, the change in the undergraduate curriculum and the move from a two-year to a four-year program is enabling us to do that. First, we're increasing the rigor. We're demanding more from students, not only in their GPA, but also in the courses that they take so that they actually can handle the problems that are going to be thrown at them in this new data-driven world. Two, we're strengthening the majors. We're giving them exposure to the majors much earlier and also much deeper exposure throughout the four years so that they're going to be ready once they come out. Three, we're developing the soft skills that employers demand. We're having a four-year intensive communication curriculum so that students are fully prepared to communicate effectively in a business setting. And four, employability. We focus on those skills that employers need beyond the technical skills, professionalism, teamwork, leadership, resiliency, adaptability. We do this through service learning, working with the community, through mentors who can be a mirror to them and tell them where they need to develop and tell them where they can shine. At the undergraduate, we're going to start requiring two semesters of statistics, where in the past we only had one. Our elective classes, even our core classes, are going to incorporate more analysis. This is at every department level. When you start out in a new career, you're going to go in and start working with people with 5, 10, 20 years of experience, right? You know, in that industry, you're coming in with basically none. If you want to make you know, significant change, you've got to back it up. You've got to have the analysis and numbers behind it of why that you should do something differently. And that's why we're putting more emphasis on it, both at the graduate and undergraduate level. Students at the Moore School are now learning about data analysis from pretty much from beginning to end. So in the beginning, taking really messy data sets, um, learning how to clean them, how to merge data sets, how to take it and turn it into some sort of predictive model, such as um, looking at optimization, forecasting, regression, what do you do with it, and then how do you get results um, at the end that could actually impact a company. We also have the you know, the new curriculum, uh, such as the concentrations at the undergraduate level and the certificates at the graduate level for kind of our top group of students that excel in this area to distinguish themselves. We want to help our students earlier in their academic careers understand their strengths and push them, if you will, or guide them, coach them into a track that will leverage their strengths and allow them the best chance to be successful in the long term. By adding an, an experiential learning element to the program, we go beyond enabling to more empowering the students to take control of their careers earlier, to be more successful both short and long term, and be confident in what they do every day. The future of rigorous business education is going to be partnering companies and the classroom together to create new student experiences. This is a whole new uh, ball game for our students. It gives them tremendous experience to not just regurgitate what they're learning in the classroom, but to actually get in to the weeds with the data, doing the analysis, and uh, learning a tremendous amount that would not be learned in a traditional classroom setting. The bottom line is companies want to hire the total package. They're clear that they get that here academically. So the important part to me is, or to the, my entire team in the office is, we're providing services, student services, at that same level. So we are all building a product that the market wants, that is the gold standard. Some of our corporate partners uh, and managers that I've been working with have told me in person, we haven't seen these types of students anywhere. We, we can't believe that they are 20, 21, 22 year old kids. Uh, where can you find uh, the passion 
in students at that level and at that age. Ultimately, when I made the decision to come to Columbia, South Carolina, it was because I, I felt I could make a difference. It, it felt like I could change lives in a positive way. As they say, the tide lifts all boats. And I think we're doing that with our students, we're doing that with our faculty, we're doing that with our alumni. We're doing that across the board in everything that we touch as a school. We have the potential to put out students who are absolutely on the frontier of what the marketplace, of what internationally is being called for. We can do it. We owe it to the school. We owe it to ourselves as faculty. We owe it to the employers. And we owe it to the students to help them be the very best they can be. We are going through a transformation at this business school that is going to change the lives of many thousands of human beings over the next numbers of years. I need your help to do that. We cannot do this alone. Please help.